Hey guys, I am here to try and convince you that A-level physics is a great option. A-level physics is a great option. Did that work? No? Okay, I actually have some reasons why A-level physics is a great option. Um, and it starts with a problem with GCSE physics. And, I mean, if I was in charge of the world, lots of things would change. One of the things that would change would be the content of GCSE physics. Because, especially in double physics, it's actually not very interesting. It's not very interesting, I'm sorry. We get like a couple of lessons where we have to teach really interesting stuff, but it's just a small part of the specification, so we generally have to teach it quite quickly. Um, and then we get to A-level, and that's where they put all the really, really cool and interesting stuff. But by that point, the only people that, you know, have stuck through with the A-level physics are like the really hardcore physics fans. Um, but A-level physics is so, so interesting. They've just saved all the good stuff until right at the end. Um, when I was at university, we used to go to this pub every Sunday for Sunday lunch. Um, and it was great because if you bought four main meals, you got a free bottle of wine. Excellent. And then if you ate all of your vegetables, you got a free pudding. We loved it. Just like... We wouldn't eat breakfast, we'd go there and gorge ourselves on all this food. It was a fantastic pub, it was, um, I think it was called the Green Park Tavern down in Bath, loved it. Um, and that's kind of what they've done with physics. You had to eat all your vegetables, all the Brussels sprouts, all of the really soggy and overcooked ones and those weird ones that you don't really know what they are. You have to eat all your vegetables at GCSE to be able to get onto the pudding that is A-level physics. Because A-level physics is really, really interesting. It's full of all the cool stuff, all the fun stuff, all the, the cool, fun, interesting stuff, basically. So, if that hasn't convinced you, universities love it as well. For several reasons. Because it's hard. Yeah, we're not getting away from that, that A-level physics is hard. But then all good A-levels are hard, so there are, no, there are really no easy options in this. It's hard. Universities like it because it's hard. Um, it can lead into loads and loads of different careers. Now, we're mainly talking about um, degrees in physics here. But it can lead really well into law. It can lead really, really well into government um, politics because of the skills that it teaches you. Because you need to analyse things, you need to investigate things, you need to write projects, you need to write reports. Um, you need to have an analytical thinking mind to do well at A-level physics. So loads and loads of companies, loads and loads of universities, loads and loads of careers really like A-level physics and physics degrees. Um, so, if you have discarded A-level physics, if you are a strong candidate, um, but you've discarded it because you think it's boring and it won't get you anywhere, well, you are wrong. It is not boring and it will get you lots and lots of places. So please just rethink A-level physics for me.